will see, you will find places of immense beauty. The David Atten was a classic. It's a cliche. Orca whale. That's an icebreaker. I don't even know what that is. It's a killer whale, mate. Come on. I think you've got some lipstick on your teeth, by the way. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I always feel like it was always going to end yeah. up being biology. The question is, what would draw me to another subject yes. over biology? We want one subject to give you the most holistic view of the Earth. I think that is biology. We go all the way from ecosystems down to, like, gene interactions. Come on. Anything you want, we've yeah. got it. Anything you want, we've got it. What makes a good biologist kind of varies. Looking at a plant and like smelling it maybe. You know, having a cheeky sniff. Curiosity, obviously. I was gonna say that obviously. One. What's that animal doing? What's that gene doing? Not being ashamed to be weird. Bit, with bit it. weird. My interviews were interesting. Yeah. Out of nowhere, the guy goes under the table, takes out a skull, puts it on the table, and he goes, Tell me what organism this is. And I was like, mm, what? It's not about how much content you know. So you have to go in knowing that you're not going to know all the answers. They're looking for someone who's kind of curious about biology and there's lots of questions. In a way, just a rehearsal for tutorials, really. Exactly. So. Tutorials are really fun. Getting off on tangents of the world experts, asking as many questions as you yeah. want. We get lectures in the Natural History Museum. This is where, like, history happened yeah. and now I'm being taught here. Yeah. You have to come through a museum and see. There's a stuffed fox that's on the desk. And you pet it. Yes. <laughs> Practicals are a good way to get to grips with the actual practical side of the subject. Once you go out in the field, you actually see biology in action. The Oriolton field trip. What a good field trip. That was a good field trip. You're doing, you know, actual like practical yeah. biology work. Then obviously the social yeah. side of it is, is so nice. I met you there. Yeah. I'm that's so why sorry. <laughs> I was expecting it to be way more formal than it mm. actually is. The tutors become your friends. Mm. They care about your welfare. They always ask mm. how you're doing outside of your degree. I wanted a small city with like just everything I needed and walking distance. Whatever comes to your mind, you'll find in Oxford. <laughs> biologists are really good at sort of work hard, play hard. Yeah, biologists are very social, they like to hang out. As little things as just going to another college's bar and then you see a few yeah, biologists yeah, yeah, there yeah, and they were like yeah, really chatty and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, we're not geographers, we are science. We did have colouring in on our lecture handout. And I think they do it very well. Yeah, they do it really well. It does feel like you're building a kind of intellectual tradition. Our lecturers will have contributed major pieces of work to this field. You're with people who know more than most people on the yeah. planet about that particular area. If you've got questions, just go for it. Cutting edge research that is going on in the world, it is actually happening just a couple meters away. Being on like a, a first name basis with like so many of these researchers yeah. is incredible. And having a cup of tea and a biscuit with, with your tutor. There is nothing better in life. Choose a tutor with a cup of tea and a biscuit. A good point. <laughs>